So today I'm going to answer a question that I get all the time. And that question is, how do I get help from Facebook? How do I get their attention? What can we do? So today we're going to answer that question. And it's actually way easier than what you might think. But it does rely on one simple thing. You need to have Facebook Business Manager set up. So if you don't have Facebook Business Manager or that's a new term to you, you need to get that set up. You can get that set up by going to business.facebook.com. It's free and it'll make your life a whole lot easier when it comes to getting the support that you're going to need. So let's dive in. Here we are. We are in my Facebook Business Manager. You'll see up top here, business.facebook.com. It's where you're gonna need to go make things really easy, what we're gonna do is just click over into any one of our ad manager accounts um, where you might have an ad account running. Here we are into my ad manager once it loads. And when we're in here, let's say we've run into an issue, a problem has happened. Oh no, what are we going to do? Help Facebook, why was my ad rejected? Help Facebook, why can't I access something help Facebook why was my ad account frozen you know there's so many different reasons why you might need to contact Facebook and it just seems like screaming into a black hole if you're like most of us because most people a lot of people at least don't know Facebook actually offers live chat support and it's a really great tool and it's very easy to get there so all we're gonna do is scroll over to this left bar over here on the left hand side scroll down to the little question mark and click help this is going to open up a screen where it looks like, uh, okay, I can contact support. Well, if we click contact support team, you're going to see what happens. It gives you this little jobby, which means, you know, you can fill out some things. Sometimes it'll open a chat bubble. Sometimes it won't. Um, sometimes it's super frustrating. So what I like to do is just immediately click over to help center down bottom. Because Help Center is always going to be there. Sometimes that other chat support button isn't there. And here you're going to be given into like the random place of like where do you find help. And it most people don't bother scrolling beyond this. And so it seems like you're in a land of nowhere. But if we scroll further down, we'll see find answers or contact support right here. So we just click get started. How can we help? Now you're going to choose what your issue is. If you're dealing with an ads issue, then click ads. If it's billions in payment, then click billion payment. For me, it's almost always something to do with ads. And then they give you all these troubleshooting generic advice things, which are great to check out if your problem is something that they have like, you know, an artificial intelligence answer to uh, or a format formatted answer already written. But lots of times your issue is you know, very personal to whatever your ad set is or your ad campaign. So instead, if we just scroll down a little bit further, we click chat representative. And here's our key to the castle, all right? We enter in your information, you answer the questions, your phone number, your relationship to the business, uh, what's your question about, your ad account ID. It even tells you how to find your ad account ID if you don't know how to find it. The fastest way is just click back over to your business manager and you're gonna see it up here in the URL, right? And so there's our account number. And if we go to the end of this URL, we'll also see our ad account ID. And so the ad account ID is right up here in the uh, URL. And there she is, 295 blah, 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 right? So we add that in as our ad account ID. What's your question about? Right. If your ad has been rejected and you click that your ad was disapproved, I found lots of times that defaults into a chat with a robot. So even if my question is why an ad was approved, I still like to have a personal chat with someone. So I almost always default to selecting other because I don't want to be sent back down a rabbit hole of pre-written blogs by robots. Scroll down, put in your subject, put in your title, give a description, click chat. Now in this description, if you say certain keywords that Facebook likely has a blog written about already, they're going to like direct you to that blog or some like waste of time robot conversation. So I'm pretty vague there. And then even after I click chart, uh, chat, you're going to get prompted with what's your question. Even there, I'm not very uh, specific because I found when I'm super specific, I get 
forced down, like force fed all these AI questions so that they can, you know, make life easier on them and not have to deal with me directly. So even after I've clicked chat and asks me what my problem is, I typically something that say something along the lines of like, I'm having an issue with an ad. And then it'll give you some like random AI questions like, oh, your ad wasn't approved. Your ad is not targeted right. Your ad isn't performing well or other. I click other. Then I get a real human being that I can chat with. And then you can get your questions answers. If your ad's been rejected once, they can help you with getting it in for an appeal. If you have questions on your creative, if you're trying to run ads for a restricted category, typically the person's fairly knowledgeable. Uh, they'll give you some advice. I've even had people call me. So this is how you access chat, real live support with an actual Facebook person. Not to be confused with a Facebook marketing expert. Um, I've found lots of times their marketing advice is off strategy, but the technical know-how and to have someone in your corner trying to push an ad through is super helpful. So if you found this helpful, uh, let me know. Or if you found another way or a faster way to do it, I'd love to hear how you're doing it. This is what works best for me. And uh, you know, many times I've had an issue or a rejected ad turned around within hours. So good luck. Get out there. And if you have questions, you know, feel free to comment below or subscribe or like the video or all that fun stuff. And I'm happy to help however I can. If you have another question, hit me up. That's how I came up with this idea. And I'll do another video and answer your question too.